Are you getting this error that your virtual analog remapping has failed? Well, uh, today I'm going to help you fix this issue. This tutorial is meant for City Skylines, but this error can occur whilst playing different games as well, and so this might be worth a shot. The first thing you want to do when this happens is just go straight ahead and restart your computer then relaunch the game and who knows it might work but it probably won't although you know it is definitely worth a shot so before we go further into, into the tutorial i thought i might just explain to you guys what a virtual alloc error is and a virtual analog error pretty much means that you do not have enough memory on your computer or that something to do with the memory has failed. Um, and now there can be a few ways to fix this. So now an easy way to decrease the amount of memory you need to use is by going into the Steam Workshop and checking how many items you are subscribed to. I am subscribed to 462 items, which is not a whole lot. Um, of course, it is 462, so it's not nothing. But depending on how many items you're subscribed to, you might want to consider unsubscribing to some items. I recommend probably a maximum of about 400 items per 8 gigabytes of RAM you have. Um, and now, of course, that may vary because of multiple things. Um, I can just demonstrate that. So we have this pack over here. It's got a few items in it, and it is 8 megabytes big. That's fine. And then we also have this item right over here, which is 186 megabytes. And of course, that is huge. And you do need to watch out for that because, you know, 186 megabytes is a lot of memory for your computer to need to load up every time. And if all 462 of these items I'm subscribed to were 186 megabytes, my game would definitely not launch. So that is something you definitely need to look at. So if you want to test if the workshop items are a problem, you can go to this cog over here, then go to properties, and here you will see launch options. In launch options, you can type dash and then no workshop, just like this. Then you can click this away and launch the game and load up your most recent save. Now um, your save should probably load a lot faster than it otherwise would if you are subscribed to a bunch of workshop items. And if it does load well, then you know that you need to subscribe to some workshop items. But what if you say, well, you know what, I have been loading this game fine for the past few times and now all of a sudden it's got this error and I haven't subscribed to new workshop items in the meantime. Well, that'll probably be because as you progress through the game, your game file gets bigger and harder to load. So um, let's say you are subscribed to 1600 workshop items, maybe for the first load that'll work fine, but maybe after about 20 hours in game in that map, um, you lo load it again, and all of a sudden it doesn't work. Well, that'll be because the file size of your save has increased significantly, um, which is of course a lot harder for the game to load. Now, this should have probably fixed your virtual analog error, and if unsubscribing to a few items didn't, then I suggest going through all your workshop items, because I accident once accidentally subscribed to something, um, to something, and there was a, something really buggy, and I'm not entirely sure what it was, but 
the file size was so big that it just overruled everything. I believe the file size was about three times as much as all my subscribed items combined. Um, and as I said, of course, this pack is 186 megabytes. This one, eight. Eight is probably about normal. 186 is big, so definitely do watch out for that. Um, and if that doesn't work, then I suggest going through all of your mods and checking that because that could create some issues. Um, if you have any questions or anything like that, then feel free to ask them down in the comments. Anyways, thank you ever so much for watching and I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.